I came to Serber's Mass to check out the public house inn. Paul had let me know that it is haunted. And behind it, I just found this old cemetery. And I came back here today to check it out. That is the inn right there. The old burial ground in Sturbridge, Mass. has several hundred graves. Many of these graves are of Revolutionary War veterans. The old burial ground was established in the 1740s and was used until 1894. The beautiful wall around it was built in 1794 by Revolutionary War veterans. This is room 40, the bridal suite that is haunted. It has a steel door in front of it that can, I guess, close off the room. There's brick around the entry. The public house inn, which is next to the old burial ground, was founded by Colonel Ebenezer Crafts in 1771. I used to be much more involved with ghost hunts and medium work many years ago. This topic is still interesting to me, so I decided to visit this haunted location last weekend. It is believed that Ebenezer Crafts haunts the ballroom since an apparition of a gentleman in colonial clothing has been seen there. My mother, who was helping me check out the inn, sensed the presence of a spirit near the bridal suite which is the most haunted room in the inn. People have heard footsteps and whispers from there. Some have seen an apparition of a gentleman with a big, tall hat residing outside of room 40, as well as doors opening and closing on their own and the sounds of breaking glass. A bartender at the inn saw a young woman in a dark colored smock and a white bonnet sitting in the pineapple room reading a book in the middle of the night. He believed that to be Mayheatable Chandler Crafts, the wife of Ebenezer. If you'd like to see more videos on haunted locations in New England, let us know by pressing the like button. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks and see you in the next video.